Lyric 8.1 is now available from Chiron. It has a great easy way for designers to use the tools built into Lyric to get a great result for headshot cutouts over animated frames. We all have a desire to use the cutouts of players and then place them on a background or into a frame. But if the background has a shape other than straight lines, it makes it difficult to mask out the headshot. But not anymore. Let's take a look. Okay, I have a headshot cutout, the player's team logo, and Lyric's 3D primitives on the canvas. Let's start with the background. It is the 3D pod primitive with rounded corners in the upper left and lower right. Then this simple texture map was added to the surface and an animation was added that rotated the texture over a period of time. Then simply copy and paste the same 3D primitive on top. Adjust the texture map and eliminate the animation. Finally, one more copy of the 3D primitive and scale it slightly using the Y scale. This third 3D primitive is going to be the mask which is the new feature in Lyric Pro 8.1. Simply right click on the pod and select mask from the list and assign it to mask layer 1. Now let's assign the same mask layer to the headshot and team logo. Finally set both images to be a mask inside. You can now see that the team logo and headshot are being masked by the 3D primitive. This is an easy way to make an abstract shape be a mask in Lyric. Now simply move the images around to position them where you want. Let's do one more thing with the headshot. When these were cut out in Photoshop, a nice soft drop shadow could have been added. But then the drop shadow would have been part of the image. In Lyric Pro 8.1, there is a new feature of adding a drop shadow to an image. Navigate to the Effects Properties and with the headshot selected, click on Add 3D Edge Border. Let's change the color to black and offset it a little in the X and Y. Finally, add some softness and make it transparent. You now have a new template for your headshots with a nice animated transparent texture and an offset drop shadow. The shape of the cutout is accomplished using the tools provided to you in Lyric Pro 8.1. This is another example of how you can easily create a different template using the tools in Lyric. You could then assign some Adobe XMP metadata to the file in Photoshop and updating these templates simply by changing the headshot is a snap. Simply select a new headshot and the team logo and player's name are automatically updated. It is another great and easy tool that we have provided to the designers using Lyric Pro 8.1 from Chiron.